आज मैं मैं इनके साथ खड़ा आज आओ जगह है निमित शाह My mother will be very upset. Nimishu. Just wait, Nimishu. Say a few words on the election. Say a few words. Oh wow. Okay. Into these, no? Or that's fine. Do I have to use this? Yes. So, what can I say? I think it was a great show, and uh, we've done uh, an extension of our brand, uh, what we believe in, uh, very well-made casual clothes for for. Every every woman, uh, it's a spirit. It's feminine. Uh, we are high on sustainable agendas. We use a lot of organic cotton, khadi. Uh, we have a zero waste factory now. So it's it's all part of our our brand building exercise and creating a product that that is relevant for today and today's woman. Uh, the spirit of the collection was very much uh, part of a holiday wardrobe, uh, which people can just pack in and go somewhere nice this summer. And uh, yeah, कोई ताली बजा। Thank you, Nimesh. Oh yeah, this. I'll just move. <laughs> we can we can do shifting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah depending. नहीं कोई बात नहीं. जब सवाल पूछोगे तो कब पूछोगे? Can I request Nikhil to say a few words on his collection? Let's let's. Chill, we'll use. Yeah, use my we'll use use my set. Um, I um, I hope you guys liked the show. It was a very uh, strong uh, show. show, show. I was always fun to showcase with friends. So it was Nimish and Nithya, and it's her birthday today. Happy birthday! Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Um, coming from the collection, it was just a very um, I'm known to be a Bollywood product. It's all these gorgeous Bollywood ladies that endorse me. So I thought, why not give them a tribute and just take inspiration from Bollywood uh, leading ladies and and because I'm a '90s product. So I was like, why not? How would it be if we take the iconic '90s songs and give the fashion a remix? And how would it be shot in today's uh, day and age with fashion keeping the forefront? So it was a my version of it. It is a combination of Pret and costume. So I was like, why not go a little gimmicky and just enjoy the show instead of being serious for once? So that was the whole synopsis. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and uh, thanks for being there. <coughs> Sure, sure. Uh, yeah, uh, you know, two of my favorite designers are here in this room, uh, Nimish and Nikhil. And I think they couldn't be more different from each other in terms of style. Uh, I, you know, um, but but it's also a little bit like me. You know, I'm extremely um, mercurial in my sense of style. Uh, one day, and it's part of my job as well. One day, I have to be like. You know, on the red carpet, looking glamorous, and the next day, you know, I've got to be like really cool and like I didn't try at all, and I just look perfect anyway. So you know, uh, so they kind of um, good dream, and they kind of covered both of those. And I had a great time. I think um, really, really beautiful clothes out there today, and uh, I especially love the whistle that was given as an accessory. So uh, well done, guys. Thank you. Thank you, Kalki. Uh, can I request Nitya Arora? Happy birthday! Thank you. Uh, can I request you to say a few words on the auction? Oh, wow! I'm so glad it's over. Um, it was such a hectic show. I don't think I've had such a hectic show ever. Um, since we were doing the jewelry for Nikhil as well, I think I was more worried about his show than I was about my own. Uh, but talking about my collection, it was very 70s, Star Wars inspired, uh, very space age. Um, I've done a lot of gold in the past, so I tried to break away from that and do something that's uh, more silver and gunmetal. Uh, we've used a lot of uh, iridescent stones and um, mixed with uh, very natural earthy tones of uh, semi-precious stones. Um, the look is very Jedi uh, meets Star Wars and... Uh, you know, very, very clean, uh, with loaded with jewelry, of course. Um, yeah. 
That's about it. Thank you. Do you have any questions? Uh, in terms of accessories, what are the trends you're looking at? Uh, I think palm cuffs are huge. I think there's a huge focus on the hands. Uh, this season, uh, palm cuffs are going to be very, very big. Um, I think even uh, headgear is getting a little more uh, elaborate and uh, you know people are being more experimental. So I think palm cuffs, headgear, and I would say uh, maybe hand braces. Um, yeah, these two things, three things for me, I think, are doing it. Anyone else? Uh, can I ask one more question? Okay, in terms of color palette, you use a lot of metallics. Yeah. Could you elaborate more? Well, um, I wanted to, I'm always known to be an evening wear designer, so I have to go with little opulence. Um, I'm more silhouette driven designer more than detail, so for me, fabric really plays a major role. This season, I want to be very rebellious, so I want to be go away from my comfort zone, and uh, that's the reason why I saw reflectors. We had decided this theme of going reflective and uh, metallic fabric some time ago, but uh, to my luck, even international and global runways were trending with the whole shine, shimmer, and glitter. So I thought it was a perfect match, and I had to go with my instinct. Hence, we went ahead. Um, the collection would have been absolutely incomplete without Nitya's perfectly matched jewelry. She was absolutely, she was more involved than what I was involved in my collection. So thank you, Nitya, so much. Um, footwear was some cools, which was, again, a very big part of it, because uh, an, an, an evening wear is incomplete without high cylinder wheels. So it came together to get, um, very well together by all these exciting people and associations, and I hope you guys liked it. Can we have a picture here? Right, right.